part two of Mass Effect 2. Let's play with the female troubleshooting start episode. That didn't make sense. Part one was just a bunch of troubleshooting. We got the mods working, everything's working hopefully now from now on out with my slightly modded version of Shepard. She had her eyes closed for the picture. Not cool. She has a chat kind of chin. Let's take the picture anyways. There we go. For my photo shoot Mass Effect 2 Let's Play. Well, just spent most of the time. Sensors activated. Damn it, Wilson. This Shut room up. is crawling with mechs. The whole station is crawling with mechs. I'm doing the best I can. Excuse me. Excuse me. Let's take a photo. With the whole Let's Play, it would just be me. Hey, best. Excuse Orders. me. Get over here. The best shots. Ah. Member offline. Ah. Then I should ah. my way to victory. Wilson, find us another. Oh God, they found me. Help. Wilson, where are you? Server room B. Hurry, they're out of control. Up the. Hey. Yeah, what? Well. Oh, more audio logs. What dead people? Tip for dead people haircuts. Generic. Physical reconstruction of subject is complete, but we still need to evaluate all mental and neurological functions. Our orders were clear. Make Commander Shepard who she was before the explosion. The same mind, the same morals, the same personality. Love it. Okay. If we alter her identity in any way, if she's somehow not the woman she used to be, the Lazarus project will have failed. I refuse to let that happen. We got Miranda's hair. Still the same from the last part. Might have been the mod that caused the issue. Caused the issue. Of my troublesome black screen stored. So just. Again. Please don't tell me that's trouble again. Gravity's one mean mother, huh? Shit. Not again. Shh. Shh. Shake up. Shepard! Nice! No! Oh. Oh. Why? Why game? Why are you doing this to me? Damn it, Wilson. This room is crawling with mechs. The whole station is crawling with mechs. I'm doing the best I can. Wilson, find us another route out of here. Oh, God. They found me. Help! Wilson, where are you? Server room B. Hurry! Over. What? 
beforehand mod is causing all those glitches. We need a no clip mod. Oh, God. Damn it. Oh, I am recording right here. Good. Sorry. The Brolog mod I downloaded. It's a Brolog framework mod. That's the one causing the issues. So I disabled it. Yeah, hopefully, they got the intro of the game. It just works now. We need to get off this station. I'm not going anywhere till someone fixes my leg. Should be some metagel in the first aid station on the wall. Hopefully, there's enough to get him up and moving again. Grab the metagel from the first aid station on the wall. Let's go back. Paragon points for shooting him. And Wilson, it's black on the screen. Wilson's hurt bad. He need really. I need to activate it like that. Thanks, Shepard. <clears throat> Never thought you'd save my life. Guess that makes us even now. Huh? Mm -hmm. I thought maybe I could shut down the security mechs, but whoever did this fried the whole system. Completely irreversible. We didn't ask what you were doing. Why do you even have security mech clearance? You were in the bio wing. Weren't you listening? I came here to try and fix this. Besides, I was shot. How do you explain that? You're all strangers to me. Let's get someplace safe and then we'll sort out whose fault it is. Right, Shepard. We need to find Miranda. We can't leave her behind. Forget about Miranda. She was over in D-Wing. The mechs were all over that sector. There's no way she survived. A bunch of mechs won't drop Miranda. She's alive. Then where is she? Why haven't we heard from her? There are only two possible explanations. She's either dead, or she's a traitor. Then why did she wake me up and warn me about the attack? Okay, maybe she's not a traitor. But that doesn't change the facts. We're here, she's not. We need to save ourselves. The shuttle bay is only a few... Mechs away. Ah, overload. Overload. This the canisters to clear up. That's it. Let's get out of here. Mm. Oh. Okay, we took him down. But this is getting tense. Shepard, if I tell you who we work for, will you trust me? This really isn't the time, Jacob. We won't make it if she's expecting a shot in the back. If you want to piss off the boss, it's your ass, Jacob. The Lazarus Project, the program that rebuilt you. It's funded and controlled by Cerberus. I mean, the logo is all over our armor. I think I ran into Cerberus a few times while I was investigating Saren. Some kind of pro-human splinter group, right? Well, that's what the Alliance wants people to believe. But there's more to it. The Alliance declared you dead. They gave up. Cerberus spent a fortune to bring you back. Look, I'd be suspicious too. But right now, we have to work together. I thought you deserved to know what's what. Once we're off the station, I'll take you to the elusive man. He'll explain everything. I promise. Oh, elusive man. Elusive man. Is he in charge of all this? Yeah. That's not his real name, of course. Nobody knows who he really is. It was a code name the Alliance used for him. Kind of stuck. I don't care what they did or what you say. I am not working with terrorists. You can tell it to the boss. But after we've saved our butts, we're almost at the shuttle. The hell is wrong with you, Wilson? I'm showing your leg being upgraded. Oh god, please. No more crap. Troubleshooting. BS. I know we just disrupt the rounds before. Yeah, I need to turn on the hacking mod. Damn it. I do I even do puzzle? No, I don't want to do this ever again. Ever. God damn again. Enough. Me, 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 me. I want to put points into the... Listen. No. Can't. Okay, isn't there a big fight coming us. up? Yeah. Off the plan. Ah. Power. Power. Ah. What the hell? System failing. It shots me. 
Oh. Oh. Oh, for us, you. And so. So, Miranda, is she a trader? Oh, boy. Oh, excuse me, ma'am. <clears throat> <clears throat> oh, boy. Unit member offline. Oh, it's your four. You show me. Ah! I shouldn't risk it. They're just sitting there. We've just infiltrated in there. Have a nice trip. Status failure. Good. Oh. <laughs> oh, you got them creep. Oh, how did you get in there? Okay, we want greens and on nutrition and on a hiking screen. It's all those vegetables on biceps. Bam. Oh, let's see. There. Dorm, oh, no. dorm. Battery, battery. Maybe I'll remember down to link that mod finally. Just um, hacking. Test subject has been recovered, but the damage is far worse than we initially feared. In addition to the expected burns and internal injuries from the explosion, subject has suffered significant cellular breakdown due to long term exposure to vacuum and sub zero temperatures. Despite the extent of the physical trauma, Wilson assures me subject is salvageable. The Lazarus project will proceed as planned. Okay, Wilson. That's been going done. We made him so generic. Besides his voice, his voice is cool. Nobody would guess that he's a. Come on, he's a... through here. We're almost at the. But, Miranda, but you were dead. Trailer. What the hell are you doing? My job. Wilson betrayed us all. You should have taken him alive. See what he knew. Too risky. I've put too much time and effort bringing you back to life to let you get killed now. You really think Wilson's capable of that? Not anymore. That smart look. Even if you're sure, did he deserve that welcome? He sabotaged the security systems, killed my staff, and he would have killed us. You sure about that, Miranda? We've known Wilson for years. What if you're wrong? I'm never wrong. I thought you'd have learnt that by now, Jacob. Oh. If you say so. What's our next step? We get on the shuttle and go. My boss wants to speak to you. You mean the elusive man? I know you work for Cerberus. Ah, Jacob. I should have known your conscience would get the better of you. Lying to the commander isn't the way to get her to join our cause. Well, since we're getting everything out in the open, is there anything else you want to ask before we go, Commander? You're the Lazarus Project's director, aren't you? That's right. I put two years of my life into this project. Into you. What does Cerberus want from me? Maybe you should ask the elusive man when you meet him. He poured virtually unlimited resources into Lazarus. Obviously, he has some kind of plan for you. Where are we going? Another Cerberus facility. The elusive man is waiting for you there. I'm not sure I trust you. This is the only shuttle off the station. You want to stay and rot with the mechs? Be my guest. What about the rest of the people on the station? This is the evac area. If they're not here now, they're not coming. We can't leave without knowing for sure. We need to go back and look. Don't you get it? The only one worth saving is you. Everyone else is expendable. She's right. We all knew the risks when we signed up. Without you, there's no point to any of this. Mm. Convenient that you show up as we're leaving. 
Where were you during the attack? Besides trying to save your life? Wilson figured out I was helping you and he sent an army of mechs to take me out. I got here as soon as I could. Probably a little too soon if you ask Wilson. Oh. I've had enough of this station to last a lifetime. Or two, in your case. Come on. Yeah, I can't, it's so weird, but it's kind of... Oh, makes it a little bit more interesting. Playing it second time on YouTube. Switch up the hairstyles. Sort of place. Still fits, kind of. Before you meet with the elusive man, we need to ask a few questions to evaluate your condition. Come on, Miranda. More tests? Shepard took down those mechs without any trouble. That has to be good enough. It's been two years since the attack. The elusive man needs to know that Shepard's personality and memories are intact. Ask the questions. This is a waste of time. I feel as good as ever. The sooner we start, the sooner we can be done. Start with personal history. Okay. Records show you grew up on Earth. Tough environment, no parents. You enlisted and you survived a Thresher Maw attack that wiped out the rest of your team. Do you remember that? I lost a lot of friends that day. Going through something like that changes you. It can break you if you let it. I read the report. Fifty Marines died on a coups. You were the only one who lived. Satisfied, Miranda? Almost. Let's try something more recent. Vermeyer, where you destroyed Saren's cloning facility. You had to leave one of your squad behind to die in the blast. Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams was killed in action. It was your call. Why did you leave her behind? I left a friend to die that day and I didn't do it casually. But I had to save as many people as I could. Ash gave her life for the rest of the team. Without her, I couldn't have stopped Saren. She died a hero. I understand, Commander. And I wasn't judging your decision. Everybody at Cerberus knows that cloning facility had to be destroyed. There mm -hmm. are other tests we really should run. Come on, Miranda. Enough with the quizzes. The memories are there, and I can vouch for Shepard's combat skills personally. I suppose you're right. We'll have to hope the elusive man accepts our little field test as evidence enough. Hmm. Cerberus doesn't support cloning, right? Right, that's what I've heard. Mass Effect Free the City Dirt. It's definitely the proof of that. I wouldn't keep the elusive man waiting. Would you know? Good shot, good shot. Anybody interesting in there looking? No, they have all bold here. Must be some sort of cult. The elusive man is waiting for you in the other room. Cool, cool, cool. What are you looking at? There we go. Then we have both blank stairs now. I get nothing in our head. Better here? No. Portal. Anyways, let's take it. Let's take the podium. Huh. One more. Let's see. I want to be tidy for the next part. Let's go in with this cool badass armor. And. No, we're not going to go in naked. Actually, we're gonna go in naked. Ah, I can't. Oops. Ah. Ah. Let's just start from this side. Damn, that armor is badass. Let's take a photo of the badass armor. It's me taking a photo of that badass armor. Yep. Good photo. Good photo. See how bad the armor this compared to Miranda's armor. Commander Shepard. Elusive man. I thought we'd be meeting face to face. Unnecessary precaution. Not unusual for people who know what you and I know. You might be the reason I'm still alive, but that doesn't mean I trust you. You need to put your personal feelings aside. 
Humanity is up against the greatest threat of our brief existence. The Reapers. Good to see your memory still intact. How are you feeling? You need to earn the right to ask me those kinds of questions. Cerberus isn't as evil as you believe. You and I are on the same side. We just have different methods. Cut to the chase. What are the Reapers doing that made you decide to bring me back? We're at war. No one wants to admit it, but humanity is under attack. While you've been sleeping, entire colonies have been disappearing. Human colonies. We believe it's someone working for the Reapers, just as Saren and the Geth aided Sovereign. You've seen it yourself. You bested all of them. That's just one reason we chose you. Sovereign was trying to harvest all life in the galaxy. Why would the Reapers target a few human colonies? Hundreds of thousands of colonists have vanished. I'd say that fits the definition of harvesting. Nobody's paying attention because it's random, and the attacks occur in remote locations. I don't know why they've suddenly targeted humanity. Maybe you got their attention when you killed one of them. Sovereign was trying to harvest all life. Damn, why Nobody, did the, I don't know why yeah, they switched position. Humanity. Maybe you got if this attention. is a threat against humanity, you need to mobilize the Alliance. The Alliance is overwhelmed by the responsibility you gave them. They're too busy building relations to put resources into verifying the Reaper threat. Blaming the abductions on mercs and pirates is easier and more convenient. Why me? You don't need to answer that. Look at that switching to get them positions. Fighting a war doesn't seem like Cerberus. Why are you involved? We're committed to the advancement and preservation of humanity. If the Reapers are targeting us, trying to wipe us out, Cerberus will stop them. If we wait for politicians or the Alliance to act, no more human colonies will be left. If what you say is true, if the Reapers are behind this, I'd consider helping you. I'd be disappointed if you accepted any of this without seeing for yourself. I have a shuttle ready to take you to Freedom's Progress, the latest colony to be abducted. Miranda and Jacob will brief you. Miranda killed Wilson in cold blood. Jacob's just a gun for hire. You expect me to trust them? Wilson was one of my best agents, but he was a traitor. Miranda did exactly what I expected of her, and she saved your life in more ways than one. Jacob's a soldier, one of the best. He's never fully trusted me, but he's always been honest about it. You'll be just fine with them. For now. Is this a volunteer job, or am I being volunteered? You always have a choice, Shepard. If you don't find the evidence we're both looking for, we can part ways. But first, go to Freedom's Progress. Find any clues you can. Who's abducting the colonies? Do they have any connection to the Reapers? I brought you back. It's up to you to do the rest. Bye. Okay, let's talk to the peeps. Then I'm gonna take the trip, and as soon as we're there, I'm gonna end it and I'm gonna slip into Tali armor. For a weird Tali meet. And great. The elusive man is very impressed with you. I'm eager to see if you can live up to his expectations on this mission. I can't have anyone disobeying my commands when we get there. I know who I report to. As long as you don't do anything to betray Cerberus, I'll follow your orders. I never got a chance to say how much I appreciated what the Lazarus Project did for me. I just hope it was worth it. A lot of people lost their lives on that station. Hey, oh, audio seems out of place here. We have to work together here. Your attitude isn't helping anything. And I have the utmost respect for your abilities, Shepard. It's your motivations that concern me. I believe in what Cerberus stands for. Only time will tell if you prove to be an asset or a liability to our cause. Okay. This is us. Set. Tell me a little about yourself. Worried about my qualifications? I can crush a mech with my biotics or shoot its head off at a hundred yards. Take your pick. I was trying to get to know you as a human being. I'm not looking for a friend, Shepard. Stay focused on the mission. Did you and Jacob serve together in the Alliance? No. The elusive man recognized my potential and recruited me at a young age. How old were you? Old enough to know this is what I wanted. What can you tell me about this colony we're going to? Freedom's Progress? 
It's a typical human settlement in the Terminus systems. They had a small military force for protection supplemented by mechs and security drones. Average in almost every way, really. Completely unremarkable. Until the disappearance. Any thoughts on what we might run into there? A lot of empty buildings and one giant mystery. I'd like to know more about the Lazarus Project from the person in charge. I wasn't in charge. The elusive man was. If I was running the show, we'd have done a few things differently. What would you have changed? To start, I would have implanted you with some type of control chip. But the elusive man wouldn't allow it. He was afraid it might affect your personality, alter your character somehow. He wouldn't let us do anything that might limit your potential in any way. Can't say I like the idea of being brought back to life with a control chip in my brain. The elusive man is taking an incredible risk with you. I just hope his gamble pays off. It's obvious you're not interested in talking. We've got an assignment. We can talk about it or we can do it. It sounds like she was controlled in different rooms with different microphones, different acoustics. I'm glad the elusive man convinced you to join us, Commander. I just want to find out what happened to those missing people. I still don't trust Cerberus. Noted. Do you trust me, Commander? Why well, is Paragon, yes. Hmm. You're a good man, Jacob. But you might be working for the wrong people. Maybe. But I thought the same when I was with the Alliance. That's why I'm here now. Do you know anything about this colony we're going to? It's called Freedom's Progress. Don't know much else. I guess we'll find out when we get there. You said you served in the Alliance. Five years in total. Stationed all over the galaxy. Even spent a couple of years as a Corsair. Damn you said it. you served in the Alliance. Five years uh, in total. Stationed I've never heard of the Corsairs. It was an Alliance initiative. They hired independent Starship captains and used them for missions that fell outside official Alliance jurisdiction. Technically, we weren't part of the Alliance. If we ever got caught, they could disavow any knowledge of us. We were supposed to be free from restrictions and rules. But there was still enough red tape to sink a cruiser. I finally just gave up. Why did you join Cerberus? I guess I just got tired of never making a difference. So much of what we did in the Alliance seemed pointless. I thought things would change after the attack on the Citadel. The old council was dead, and humanity took control of the new one. But nothing changed. Politics, bureaucracy, same bullshit, different leaders. Cerberus is different. When colonies go missing, we don't commission a team to write a report to figure out what the hell to do about it. We just go and find out. That's all for now. Yes, ma'am. Yes. Okay, give me. Taliyama. We are Tali now. Yep. That's gonna confuse people. Okay. Photo mode. This should work fine. I don't think the Tali face mode works for this armor. Maybe? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Let's just go out there. That's Tali. To meet Tali. To do some Tali things. We should be there shortly, Shepard. The elusive man put us under your command. Do you have any orders? <laughs> That's so weird. Already. I like it, but it... Uh... Especially when she talks, it will be unusual. What makes you think this investigation will turn up anything new? At other colonies, official investigators got there first. Sometimes looters or salvage teams as well. We're hoping to be the first ones there this time. Maybe find clues before somebody else disturbs the scene. Are you sure you'll be comfortable following my orders? We didn't bring you back from the dead just to second guess you, Commander. If the elusive man says you're in charge, you're in charge. What did you find at the other colonies? Nothing. No signs of attack, no corpses, not even a trace of unusual genetic material to give us a clue. They just disappear, and we've got no target to go after. Our first priority is to look for survivors. That's unlikely, Commander. No one was left at the other colonies. They were completely deserted. Be nice to find somebody. Anything's better than another ghost town.
still the goddamn same reshade mod is used. What? Do I have another gun? Holy. I have all the guns. Is that? Oh, yeah. Okay, they equipped me. They equipped me. I'm gonna mess with that in a second. Very far soon then. What was I trying to say? I downloaded another reshade mod, but it kinda doesn't fit. So I'm back to the old one. But I still wanna show it off before I delete it. Someone's personal reshade, it's a little bit more grey. I mean it something about it feels off. Would be perfect for this ghost town. I'd rather have the decay reshade, but I can't find it anymore. That's kind of looking more blurry too. That's this reshade that I brought will delete. Oh. I'll try the Sin City reshade here. No, no, let's not mess with it. Let's make a group photo. photo yeah Jacob is kind of messing it up bam good good let's go to the door at least a little bit of looks like everyone just got up and left right in the middle of dinner more gaming time maybe I find something to hack that I can just then <sighs> make me remember Download the mod. Well, I don't need to hack. Crap. Strange. No bodies, no structural damage, and no signs of battle. My face kind of glitched. I saw him in a ghost town. Ah, okay, okay, save. Good, good. Good, yeah, we're done here. I'm gonna download more mods that's gonna mess with the game. Maybe even a different hair mod already? No, not yet.